Go to the beginning, Vinny. Like right there, you'll see it. Well, I'm under the knife. There you go, right there. Boom. Ew, watch this, watch Joey. This. Oh Ew! my god, dude! Whoa! What, what are you doing? Joey. Why would you put that on YouTube? That's so gross. <laughs> yeah, I can't. I can't. Ew. I can't. Get it out. Get it out. Ew, <laughs> sinner! All right, everyone, welcome to Out and About. We're here with our good friend, Lucas. It's great to be here. It's great to be back. Lucas Zelnick. That's right. <gasps> Did you guys see this? Just, There's oh, a Winston. dog in the studio. Oh. His name is Winston, according to the boys. Winston. And he just jumped up on my lap. And now dog we're, is now we're in I got it from Rover. I told you. I'm working there now. Ladies, I have a new job. Now she's booked and busy. <laughs> I signed up for Rover, and I'm a dog watcher. So if you want your dog watch, go to my profile on Rover and book me. I found this. I'm going to see mine until Tuesday at 3. God damn. He's he with Lucas. is absolutely minuscule. I love him. I want him. He's a lap dog. I've always wanted a lap dog. Yeah. Um, you can be like a lap dog sometimes. I could be a lap dog to somebody. He's just with you because you have peanut butter in your balls. <laughs> that's, that's the only reason he's there. <laughs> I, I thought we weren't going to bring that up on the podcast. Well, Joey applied it. Speaking <laughs> of it, chunky or smooth? Um, smooth. Yeah. Hairy or terry or smooth? Smooth. Damn. Then I kind of like Who's chunky. chunky and hairy. I Do like chunky and hairy go together. They're called bears, dear. Ugh. I like chunky peanut butter. Next to <laughs> peanut, chunky peanut butter can be good sometimes. Chunky peanut butter? I don't eat peanut butter. I'm allergic. Hmm. It is funny. Lucas smelt the bagels and schmear from the street, and we actually didn't even have them booked. And he I walked did. Right in. I did. I I walked in with a bagel in hand, and uh, and it was incredible. Did you see Loud Luxury was here? Uh, I saw there was a DJ. There was a lot. You know what I saw when I walked in? Is I saw There's a guy. Jokes. In a Kith shirt and Yeezys, and I went. <laughs> Who is it? I went. What is Barstool becoming? I mean, who, is, who was it? One I don't know what I'd rather. Like you guys be the company of loafers and pink shorts, or yeah. Kith shirts and Yeezys. I think I'd actually rather you guys be in salmon shorts and 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 knit belts or whatever. Who was yeah, it? Yeah. I wonder. It was live event, Lisa. <laughs> I don't know who it was. I hope it wasn't one of your employees. It wasn't the DJ. No, I don't. There, there was no DJ. There was just turntables when I got here. Maybe it was Nick Pippen. Oh, they left before. The, 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 but there was a band here earlier. Was that a publicity stunt? Publicity stunt. It could have been. I don't know what it was, but it was. Um, it was interesting. I think that's our that's our answer to combating with the uh, yeah. Chicago office. Chicago has camaraderie and fucking morality. We have a we have a DJ on on Bagel Day and a and a Bagel Day. What'd you do this weekend, Joe? You don't mind if we catch up real quick? Do you? Oh, please! Yeah. In front of me, I feel like <laughs> I'm, I'm in the cock chair now. It's, it's <laughs> just good to cuck. watch you guys. What um, I enjoy. did this weekend? I yeah. I think you don't know what you did. Friday, today. Oh, I went. To, oh, I went to dinner with, on Friday with um, d- um, Prima Dante. Dante the Dante. Don- oh, go to Dante's Twitter. Joey took the gayest photo in the history of Twitter. <laughs> Him Who, and Dante. Who's Dante? This Dante's is a guy, I'm seeing, a guy I'm seeing. Yeah. This oh, is okay. A guy that Good for seeing. you. Where'd Thank you guys go? We went to Jean's restaurant. Are you? It's on Dante's You had a Twitter. boyfriend last time. I do have boyfriends, so I'm kidding. Oh, okay. It's, um, yeah. It's, okay. Uh, it's just a guy that works with Same us. boyfriend? Still? Same boyfriend, yeah. Two oh, years wow. this, uh, this August. And are you guys, you Love? just fuck each other? Oh, we're single. I mean, we're, we're um, monogamous, yes. Oh, wow. Not uh, that I'm surprised. Yeah. Oh, is that me? There he is. This is like. That's really gay. Where's your hand? On his thigh. How high up? It was pretty high up. Show me on Lucas. <laughs> <laughs> um, we went to a very fancy restaurant called Jeans. It's like, I think it just opened. It used to be just pro- members only, but now it's open to everyone. Now they let the riffraff in? Let the riffraff in. And um, I got to say, I have the best, best food I've had in New York City probably in 10 years. Really? I was up blown away. I'm, the chick, there's this chicken dish there at Jeans. I was violently angry because it was that good. I was like, how the fuck <laughs> did they do that? To a chicken breast. What else did you eat? We had, uh, we had the seafood tower. Okay. Um, we were out. I was out with the um, Casamigos girls and oh. your good friend Ramsey. Ah, who are the Casamigos yeah, I know girls? Ramsey. What's that? Who are the Casamigos girls? They are. Is the this whole brand podcast reps. references to people I don't know? It's gonna be. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> hang tight. <laughs> we um had okay, we had a seafood tower. Yes. Then we had this caviar sandwich that'll blow your balls off. Okay. The, the little shot of bisque on the side. Um, we had the tagliatelle. We had the chicken. Um, Chicken frites, as I like to call it. Oh we also God. had um, the bussy, the burger, oh. bussy burger, um, exquisite drinks, beautiful gowns, beautiful gowns, beautiful drinks. gowns. And then we went over to um, you went to the club. Went to the club after, and then did you do drugs at the club? Um, 
<laughs> yes, the hotel there and at the restaurant and <laughs> at my house. I was, that's why the food tastes so good. You were it was the first time eating sober. Um, and then Bay came to club and his friends, and then we all went back and hung out at your um, house. We sat at Bay's house actually. Bay hosted until what time? I left at five thirty a.m. Yeah. Well, how late do you go out when you go out? Oh God. I mean, I don't really go out too much. Are you much. sober? No. Okay. Good. <laughs> Jamie's sober. Oh, the Jamie. Right. I, I, drink, I drink, but I I stay sober before I go on stage. So like when I finish shows, what do you do on stage? I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know what? I ask myself the same. You're, question you're in loud all the luxury, time. correct? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, you, you, so you stay sober on stage? I stay sober on, sit, on I stage. I want to start doing that. But the second he gets off, he gets fucking junked up in the yeah. In the then back, I, like Ray Charles. Charles heroin. No, yeah. but you know what? If I'm gonna go out, it has to start at midnight. So I can't. If I go out, I go out late. Yeah. I go out till the morning. But like, I don't really go out. Yeah. Maybe once, uh, two months. I'm not a goer out. Or I did see Playboy Marty. Out this weekend, he's on, you uh, ran into him. No, we went out. We went out for a drink. Where'd you it guys feels go? like you're doing a bit now. You're just making up people that I don't no, know. No, no, no. You remember Playboy Marty was here? Maybe last time you weren't here when the last time they were here. Yeah, our old producer. We went to the Corner Bistro. We had a couple cocktails, and went back to my place with him, with him, and hung out. Do you what only happened have, there is between do us. You only he have gay? no. He's straight. You've only only two people have been in your apartment are Vinny and Marty. <laughs> two, two producers. From I here. have a type. <laughs> it's the type that works for me. <laughs> <laughs> but it was good. I did go mega viral this weekend oh. on JoJo Siwa. Pull up the Vinny, would you mind pulling up the JoJo Siwa? Do you know the dance? I oh, yes. I had I learned it in like two seconds. JoJo Siwa was here. I only have maybe forty three thousand Instagram followers. I got seven million views, eighty thousand likes, eighty thousand shares, eight thousand comments. JoJo Siwa, but it's all like you're a f- all the comments. Look at this. <laughs> Look. Is this not the craziest fucking thing? Well, everyone's saying that Myra Lopez did it better. <laughs> wait, wait, where, where are the comments? Can we pull up some funny comments? The good ones are going to be <laughs> Not the funny. Sorry. It's not yeah. funny to call you a slur. It's mean. Yeah. Oh, or- you got to really scroll, Vinny. There's 8,000. Do you usually get 8,000 on yours or like more than that? Or cool. Yeah. All right. cool. yeah cool. I do cool. get a lot. We do dick measuring. Right. And the, the comments are usually the same. <laughs> same as yours. <laughs> uh, Why looks she like, like- here's one. Looks like a cokehead. Yeah. That's what is fair. bro doing? Jojo is a gremlin. What is bro? Now, why oh, this she... one is ESL. El San Nibaro Para. <laughs> why was she dressed like Bob the Builder? <clears throat> it's her thing. She was just in costume. But I thought she would change. She was doing Fallon that night. Jo- Jojo is all in trouble now, right? What did she do now? Uh, I don't know. I think she's just She's about like, to turn 21. She's, and she's, she's like doing canceled. anything. Her party's going to be at Disney Disneyland. It's called anything but alcohol. There's more spin. She spam- doesn't like drinking. She doesn't? No. So she's not on 24. She's not going to get drunk. She's going to be spee. Um, um, well, I mean, we're giving it probably five or six views right here. Yeah, I don't know why. Did See, you it's all a- in, sp- it hit Spanish Twitter though. What's that one say? Esta. Marina tan something. Can we translate that? What's that say? This little girl something wrong. <laughs> <laughs> this- <laughs> Dude, people ate it up. <laughs> This little girl has something wrong indeed. It's, you I know mean, it's- not everything's going right for her. Does she have, is she, is, does yeah. she have like intense... Di- um, I'm sorry, Mike. Um, ma- masculine energy. Yeah, she's um, gay. I know, but there... she's, she's very butch. It's it's it's, 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 it's yes, aggressive. But it's, it makes me feel bombarded. It's grounded in like a, like a calmness, though. It's not confrontational. Like she was very sweet, and the camera turned on. She switched on. Teeth are whiter than you could fucking imagine. Oh. She crushed. Um, lots of likes. Did it help? It didn't grow your following at all. Doesn't oh, seem... I got like 2,000 followers, maybe okay. 1,000. Right. So not That's much. Something. Not much, but I don't you know. You guys went to Cap City Comedy Club? Yes. Yeah. How was that for you? Uh, I like the green room. They have an elevator the there. The green room, they had an ADA yeah. elevator. That was the big yeah. thrill of the weekend. Yeah. Forget the performance. You guys we got saw an there. ADA elevator. I've never seen Nana light up like crazy. <laughs> I love anything like a, Oh, you know. I know Colton and Dylan. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're yeah. great. Uh, you went guys. on their show. I did. They're yeah. great. They do a little game called someone's topping someone's bot. Who'd you fuck? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Should we I know, how it goes. I know how it goes. It goes, if you were gay, which one would you have sex with? I'm a top, she's a bottom, we both love oral. Yep. That's the funniest thing. We both love oral. And then he was like, get <laughs> he was like, change the fact that like Something bottoming there. sounds worse to you. And I was like, well, that's definitely relevant. We have a t shirt right there from them. Oh yeah. It says breedable. Do you want to which one did you on? choose? To the topping yeah, or the I'll bottoming? Oh, what did you choose? Who are you fucking? Oh, I decided to fuck um, Colton. That makes sense. Colton's a bottom, right? Yeah. yeah. Same question for Joey and I. Um, We're both into fisting. Neither of us. I'm a top. <laughs> I'm a top. He's the bottom. And we both. Are you a bottom? 
Er vi... <laughs> oh, that's why I didn't hit me the big box. Yeah, uh, yeah. So I, I got a joke in. A black. Uh, we still need a Japanese Asian joke black. In there no, there was a boba tea. Boba I believe tea. that was before we were recording. At least I hope yeah. so. <laughs> would you it's ever fun. go to? A, would you ever I'll go to a racially me, charged fine. boba tea place? <laughs> racially uh, charged. <laughs> uh, that sounds like a different way to enjoy the tea. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, honey, that, we're going to be spilling the tea tonight. It's, it's the tea, mama. <laughs> Two types of tea. That's what it's called. Have you ever smoked Extra tea? Extra special guest judge. <laughs> Lucas. <laughs> Did you see the Ashley Madison doc? I was watching it the other night and then uh, we fell asleep. What'd you, we? My girlfriend and I. The show is over. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> What'd you think? Um. Yeah, I was liking it. Really? I like how they're doing it. Ashley Madison's great. What's everyone so upset about? I mean, I didn't get to the data leak part. I'm sure that was it upsetting. It was awesome. It was, yeah. you, you watched a little bit of it last night. I watched night, a little bit of it. Right? Yeah. I, I was, I was, I was um, distracted by that fat queen that was, that. Oh, does he own the place? <laughs> oh, you're talking about oh, the yeah, guy? Yeah, yeah. I know exactly. That guy's, that guys awesome. Look up the guy does he who owns the, it. He's does got he own the place? He was brought in to do like marketing. And he was, given, he was like, their sales He was given guy. like oh. 10 per, oh, was sales. He, yeah, yeah. Was he really gay? Yeah, well, she's, she's dressing up in geesh. Yeah. <laughs> she's got. He was given ten percent of it. Ashley Madison, fat gay. Man, That's the guy picture, right there. That's my, the guy. my picture shows up. Down, there he is. down. No, no, no. Oh yeah, there he is. He had the glasses on. But the long and short of it, this is the second. No, that was the CEO though. That guy's no, no, now. go back. Um, That's the CEO go, too. Scroll go down, back. Vinny. Scroll down. There, the picture. There we go. Her. Yes. So they had. Th you need her on your podcast. They had yeah. 37 million users. They claimed at one time, and Gross. now like they're saying that this documentary is like spiking things back up. So I wrote a blog. Just does it still exist? Yes, 365,000 monthly users. So this... I wrote a blog destroying them, and they actually reached out to me, being like, "We want to come on the show and defend ourselves." Really? Yeah. On this show? Yeah, I said no. It was like there's nothing. I mean, I was mean in the blog. How many were you? I was hungover. I was in a bad mood. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> just being in a bad yeah. mood, just taking down. I an called entire them all company. moron. I was like, I was like, their company is built on lies. Like it's all fake. Blah blah blah. And they were very upset about it. I love how Did you're you now on GPT your own show and, before and they Donald even... Trump's vernacular. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Before you, they even defend themselves, you're like, I was kind of just in a bad mood. I was literally I in a bad mood. Really, my opinion on the blog is strictly dictated. I don't by care my about them being <laughs> fake. I just care about what they're promoting if infidelity, which I think is, I think it's worse than murder. But if people are going to do it anyway, they're not going to do it anyway. They're promoting it. I Infidel? think it is because you have to die if, after that. After, after you get, after you, get um, you know, cheated on like if that, your you still have to live. Have you ever cheated? I would never. Have you? <laughs> and your boyfriend's never cheated on you? No. To your knowledge? No, I know he doesn't. Okay. And if he did, you would do what to him? I'd murder myself. I'd, I'd kill her. myself. Well, that would give him what he wants. You'd have to do something else. You think else. he wants me dead? If that would, like, get him out of, like... Out of the punishment. Yeah, I mean, yes, I do think he wants you dead. Um, I don't know what I, I don't know what the question is here. Um, what would I do if he cheated on me? I don't know. I, I would be very upset. Yeah. It would hurt. But um, but I don't know. I don't like how they're promoting this. And I don't like how these so-called Republican religion here we uh, go. people here we go. Not are going on this site and, and promoting this and okay with this because it's, you know, but, you know, a, a girl a, a girl can't wear a suit to a fucking prom, but they're, <laughs> that they can fucking cheat on their wives. They're pig fucking <laughs> wives. <laughs> Well, that was the thing. The thing that I wrote in there. I there were so many different opinions yeah, espoused I don't know why, there. That I couldn't lot. tell which side you were on. Hey, guys. Joey and I are going on tour, and tickets are on sale right now. Make sure to go to nowshewilltour.com right now to get your tickets. I said 365,000 users, and they think that they're going to be bigger than Instagram. For like Did they just launch again? Yeah, or they've been around, I guess. So why is it why is it why is it now? Like for they say that they're more relevant for like cheating and stuff than Instagram. Well, well Instagram's not it's Instagram a is, the, is the is the dating site. I it think is, Instagram yeah. is more right. Yeah. Instagram is yeah. more than any dating app. Yeah, it's like you just slide in. Really? Yeah. Slide in the DMs. For yeah. sure. Well, you used to slide in DMs. Foot professional football players, he'd say, "Wreck my hole." He'd no, I did never. I never thing. slid in the DMs. And you know what? I did never. I never dated on social media. Because last time I dated. There wasn't social media. That's how I used Before, Instagram I was, I was for sure. For twelve years, when I was single, yeah, yeah. I would I would just slide into DMs for sure. Really? What was your opening line? What I that always pussy do. I think I used to. <laughs> <laughs> I always used to say something like, "What that pussy do?" Yeah, <laughs> um, yeah. I'd always say it, but in a kind of in a, a more formal tone. What would be um, your opening line to Joe? I, I would say, what, "What did I say?" I think I said, um, "What." what what the hell is going on? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> yeah. What the hell is going on? You go full Seinfeld? Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. 
Yeah. I watched that new it movie works. from Seinfeld. Pop Tart? Yeah. No, it's Uncrusted. It's about Pop Tarts, though, right? Yeah. yeah. And how was it? It was very <laughs> um, campy. It's supposed to be like the worst movie of all time. Was it? Yeah, it's supposed, supposed to be, to be really fucking bad. terrible, but Stephen yeah. Che loved it. I liked it. I thought it was. It was. It was very. It's, it's very. It's, it's a kids movie. It, yeah, it's the most. It's the most non-animated animated cartoon movie. It's like it's not. A, it's a, it's a, it's not a cartoon, but it seems like it feels like a cartoon. It's like written like a cartoon. Uh, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's very I like. like I'm good with it's that. It's very like yeah. punchline and like uh, fast and like. Uh, I don't know. And it's called Pop Tart. No, it's called. <laughs> It's called Uncrustable. And then <laughs> Amy, Schumer, Amy Schumer's in this show. Actually, not the about cast, her panties. Anytime the cast is like too star-studded, it's not going to be good. Yeah, it's very star-studded. Is Meryl Megan. Streep in it? I didn't see Streep, but I saw like... <laughs> Dua Lipa? Um, she's probably in it. Um, I, it was um, Seinfeld and Louis Megan... C. K. Uh, not Megan. Um, Louis C.K. was Ma- starring. Melissa McCarthy. As, as, yeah. the, <laughs> as the Pop-Tart who beat off in front of the other Pop-Tarts. Amy Schumer's in it. <laughs> yeah, it did. Oh, he I had to frost the Pop-Tart. He <laughs> defrost it. it. <laughs> <laughs> I watched uh, Challengers. You know that movie was. Oh, Zendaya? I heard that was great. It was good. It was like very Steamy. sexual and intense. Well, it's it just was, it was like the scene of them like hanging out in the hotel room. It was like literally forty minutes of the movie was them like leading up well, to like a kind of game. Don't ruin threesome. it, Pat. Yeah, I want well, no it. spoilers, but there's two. They don't love fuck. interest. Spoiler, and that's all I was there for. There's, there's two, two love interests. That was yeah. a huge spoiler. Yeah. Did she show her knockers? Um, I heard no, but I heard her body looks insane, them. and you get side titty. You, you get side titty. <laughs> you get. A, you were given a little bit of side titty <laughs> as a nips. gift for That's patronizing good. the film. You saw her nips for sure. You see nippies? Yeah. But how nippies does she show her shirt? Then? They're through her shirt. Ah. Uh, and the guys make nips out. Are not nips. Oh, the guys make out. It was hot. She like she's evil though. Did you watch it? No. No. Can you and could you not? She's the most, It's one of the most evil You're movie ruining characters it for him. I've ever seen. You're ruining a movie that I'm legitimately gonna go see. You're gonna watch it for sure. It's like all the rage right now. I just haven't gotten around to it because I was working. It was good. She plays the same character, I feel like. It's always just like manipulative. like Yeah. You know what I mean? I'm not planning on seeing that. But I do <laughs> want to see the new movie um, with um, Michelle. Pfeiffer. No. Michelle. Ryan. Wolf. No. Michelle Obama. and, and Alana oh, Glazer. Oh, is Michelle Obama Mich- finally starring? He is, yes. <laughs> Michelle Batista, what's her name? What's the movie? We had her on, my friend Michelle Buteau. Michelle Buteau. Michelle Buteau. And Michelle Lana Buteau. Glazer have a new movie out about Ooh. pregnancy. Oh, well, you have. Oh woman. You yeah, have yeah, woman yeah, movie. yeah. Babes, babes. Yeah. I'll tell you what. You that is one I'm gonna skip. <laughs> Me too. Oh no, I'm gonna see <laughs> yeah, it. Skip. Answer it on speaker. You know the rule. Oh. Sorry. Oh, there's the doggy. <laughs> Hello has been trying to reach you with an urgent message. You are pre-approved for a $51,000 oh my God. financial hardship alternative program. <laughs> financial hardship alternative. Back. Joey's applying so for PPP like- loans. <laughs> it's the alternative <laughs> to financial hardship. Um, You have womb envy. Have I have heard of that? that. I want to get pregnant what's, so bad. What's womb envy? Like, I wish I could get pregnant. Oh. Shit. Like, if a woman is pregnant, he will get jealous that he doesn't have a baby inside him. Do you want to have a baby? I just want to see it on the subway. <laughs> oh my god! I've never seen it subway. <laughs> Ew. Um, public transportation grosses me out. You take it all the time. Joey, Joey's a train conductor on the weekends. <laughs> Can you imagine if my rover job's not working? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know um, if I'm going to see. I don't know if I'm going to see that movie. Although I did like her. She's very funny. Very, very talented writer. Michelle. She, oh, her. she's the first female who's doing Radio does that City. Have, does that have a good wait? What do you mean? What? What's she doing? Isn't she? Oh, Alana is. No, uh, Michelle Buteau. She's like the first like female comic to like sell out one. It's like coming up, I think. Michelle no. Buteau. I th- no, she's think not. So. Heather McMahon did it. The fuck? Are or you no, she's about? doing something. Maybe the, first, maybe the first black trans woman that's performing. That could, that could <laughs> be it. She put it up on her fucking Instagram. What's she doing? I don't know. Full heart, tight jeans. Which is funny. Yeah. <gasps> Shut Whiskers. the fuck up, Whis. Oh, sorry. Yeah. PB come. Seven nominations for Thickest. I have to go. I don't know. <laughs> you guys got this. Right? I Whiskers don't come. Know. Where are you performing lately, yeah, you're Zach? Right. Am I right? Um, yeah. I mean, it seems like she's doing something at Radio City. I don't know if... It... Okay, you go do your thing. We'll be right. I don't, we'll, I don't we'll know what the rule on. is about uh, female on. comedians at Radio City, but... Yeah. Well, they typically don't allow them. Joey just lets the dog out on 7th Avenue. <laughs> That's what I would do. He was like, watch it. 
I was, I was like, I'm fucking good. Where are you performing lately? Uh, well, I'm on the road, but I have two international dates Damn. over the summer. I'm going Where? to London and Amsterdam. Hell yeah. July 7th, July 8th. Where are you doing? The Round Theater? No. Is that, that, the, I, is that where the Shakespeare? I, yeah, it's the Shakespeare Theater. <laughs> a well-educated man. I'm, I'm well at the Leicester man. Square Theater. Ah. Doing a theater in London. That's a big deal for Hell me. Yeah. I hope that I sell the tickets. How, how big is the theater? It's only like 400 should be possible. There you go. It's like a comedy club. It's just consolidating into one show. Do you have a, a British following? I think so. We'll find out. My friend Kat Cohen just went over there. She goes, goes yeah, to yeah, like yeah. Australia. Yeah. She, she is fucking hilarious. She, people love Kat Cohen. People Very love funny. Kat Cohen. She, I'm, I'm in a way I kind of, she and I sometimes have the same audiences. Weirdly. How, how so? Well, I have basic white women, and she's like the queen of basic white women. She is. Yeah. I saw her do the Joe's Pub show. I went to the recording of that. Yeah. Wildly funny. Well, I will say I, I, my fans are not basic if they like me. That makes them <laughs> unique, different. You have your Matt awesome. Rife moment. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you you <laughs> isolate all your friends. Oh, my God. Nana's That's got a Jew schmear. bagel. Nana's got a the schmear. The fact that you didn't get me in everything is cruel, but the I right? still eat it. I, that wasn't everything. I licked off the seasoning for you. <laughs> <laughs> we see this for a clip. <laughs> a real Jew eating a real New York Jew bagel. <laughs> it's a rarity. Bagel. It's a rarity. No, it's not. I love how he went right into it. Didn't even think twice. Doesn't no, even have a water. Doesn't have anything. You guys, listen. You want to bring me on the show? I have. You I want feel a so Jew eating a bagel? Well, let them walk. <laughs> what would you? What would you have? That's us his only on chance. On my show, show? monkeypox scars. I've been on your show before. Yeah, you've been on my show. Yeah. What would you have him? Do? What would you? What would you? What would you have us do on your show that? Well, I walked yeah, in. They, would, they would like eyes. fetishize your gayness. Yeah, <laughs> suck <laughs> each other's dicks. <laughs> <laughs> That's the gayest thing I can think dick? of. No, I've never sucked a dick. You've you... not got sucked off in your sleep at college. <laughs> in your in my sleep? sleep, I've never been <laughs> Joey. To my knowledge, <laughs> to my knowledge. Um, this is actually a monkey puck scar. You never beat off with uh, old Jamie, your pal. No, I've never done a circle jerk with my old pal Jamie. Are you still doing? What would we do on your show? Uh, to prove you're gay. Kiss on the lips. That's gay. That's okay. We've done that. You guys have definitely proved to me that you're gay. I mean, you. Okay. We were just. I mean, we don't have to do more. Has Vinny proved you he is gay? Are you gay? Yes. Please. <laughs> girl. <laughs> <laughs> Miss girl. <laughs> Vinny. Vinny, you're gay. I'm. I'm heading that direction on the show. They're, they're Speaking slow, of they're gay, getting it we have a surprise guest. I think I could gay huh? at some point in my life. I don't know if I want to die without gaying. I never had some, I never touched a vagina. I, I figured my friend John on the couch once, but I never penetrated a vagina. What do you do with your fingers? Well, yeah. that's interesting. I mean, you got well, here's the thing is if you're straight enough to be straight, then you don't really need to be gay because it's a bigger lift to get a dick. Dicks are a lift. Men are a know. lift. But if I you're, think women are way more yeah. of a lift than men. No. There's all those laws and stuff with women. <laughs> women <laughs> You know what I mean? Like you can't like drive. Yeah, <laughs> there's all those laws. Do you know what I mean? It like, seems like you're always gonna get in trouble. Like if you like, you know, I I, mean, I can I can. God I, forbid you say the wrong thing. Warmer, sunnier dates are coming up, so fuel up with them with the factors. No prep, no mess meals. Meet your wellness goals for summer thanks to the menu of chef created meals. Options like calorie smart, protein plus, and keto. Factor's fresh, never frozen meals are dietitian approved and ready to eat in just two minutes. So no matter how busy you are, you'll always have time to enjoy nutritious, great tasting meals. Make today the day you kickstart a healthy new routine. What are you waiting for, Joe? Um, well, 35 different meals and 60 add-ons to choose from every week. You always have new flavors to explore. Crush your wellness goals this May with dietitian approved meals, ingredients you can trust. Make your days delicious from breakfast, desserts, stay fueled with easy, nutritious options. I actually order Factor. I love it. It makes things so easy. Just pop it in the microwave. It's great. You feel healthy, you feel strong, and you feel like you accomplished something. So we're going to give you guys a deal. Head to factormeals.com slash out50 and use code out50 to get 50% off your first blocks plus 20% off the next month. That's code OUT50 at factormeals.com slash OUT50 to get 50% off your first box plus 20% off your next month while your subscription is active. Factor Meals. Speaking of which, I have a special guest coming in. Who? Is it me? Former member of Junior Mafia, my friend Sean. 
P. Diddy Combs. Ah. Mm. He's actually going to tell his redemption story on the show. I know you had mentioned his that. His redemption story. What do you think about him beating his ex-girlfriend Cassie? I think it's fucked up and I think he should be in jail. But the statute of limitations, you like can't put him in jail because he, it happened in 2016. What How are his claims that? about Diddy? I was actually trying to investigate this morning. Um, Beyond. I think, I think, let's, let's all guess what the claims we think the I know are. what the claims are. I don't know what they are. I'm going to guess it is having, using his power... Uh, using his power uh, to like scare people into ha- doing sexual acts with yes. him. Yes, um, I think he, I think he fucks. In fr- I think he likes to get like fuck uh, in front of people. That's not a crime. No, but like me forcing them. Like, it is according to yes. you with your ex boyfriend. Facts. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> um, him like using his, yeah, that. I, th- I think maybe fit, maybe diddling, maybe touching underage or dating underage girls. Um, using his money, using his power for assault, <laughs> human trafficking, sex trafficking, drug charges. Uh, I don't know about that Black one. Blackmailing. You Black can't say mailing. that. Is he a p- <laughs> but he did that. But the woman Cassie, who he dated, he, he so signed pretty. her to Bad Boy when she was like seventeen or eighteen, and then when she was nineteen, pr- I just Groomer. wrote about this. Pressured her into doing it. Pressured her into dating, and it was this long, terrible thing. But the thing that came out was the video of him smacking her around in the hotel, and he issued this fucking apology, My question is, which is the most half-ass bullshit apology of all time. He should be in jail. My question is, he did that. He must. I was thinking he must have rented that entire floor out. You ha- He had to. But I he's guess not going to ho- run in the hallway with his towel on. First of all, even if he wasn't chasing the woman, you're not going to run out naked in, in the towel. Get this. So after that happened, he went down to the lobby and allegedly gave the staff fifty grand in cash to erase the footage. They didn't erase the footage, and then lo and behold, when this shit comes out a month after the statute of limitations is up, the footage gets released. How much would Loud Luxury have to pay you? To release the, to delete the footage of them doing something bad in the, in the house here. Loud luxury. Yeah. Say they say, say that the guest was doing something bad. Say say he was doing something. Lucas was doing something bad in the kitchen. Like he was fucking the bagel with cream cheese. How much <laughs> is would that? You what have to you pay think the worst thing I would, is? I'd watch it. I don't know if he. How much would you pay to have that footage deleted? Me but, fucking a bagel with cream cheese. No, you can yes. just say but you could, uh, maybe a black something bagel, really bad. Black seed bagel. <laughs> <laughs> How much would you pay to have that footage How much deleted? would I pay to have damaging footage erased? Sexual fetish footage erased from the internet. Yeah. No, 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 no. You can't pay for that because then you've done two things. Yeah, then you're trying to... I've had friends who... It's a very smart analogy about life. Yeah. Got, now you did two got, bad things. Got can- like, she was getting canceled, right? And there was like a whole paper trail of like... Someone was upset with her. She, she didn't really do anything. Mm. She's a comedian. And comedians are always innocent. And comedians are always <laughs> innocent. Protect comedians at all costs. We're the last protected group. And um, she was asking, like, if she should, like, cover the tracks of the things leading up to the incident. And I was like, no, because then if someone fi- – I was like, you haven't done anything wrong. And if someone finds out that you've been, like, deleting then messages, then you look guilty. Uh, but what? Who is? what is this you're talking about? I think I know what it is. What do you think it is? Was this about a particular comedian in the New York scene in the mid – 20 teens who was really creepy with girls no oh never it's mind. a girl it's a girl he said it's a girl oh, but I, was, I thought you meant like the girl would cover it up or something oh no 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 this is a woman so how much would you pay <laughs> <laughs> well i have you know money to spend but yeah cover You're up rich we hush forgot. money yeah how but hush you, money sounds no no of no interest to me you'll end yeah. up well you'll be fine unless you're donald j trump then you'll end up in yeah then, you, then you'll be in real trouble i forgot you're rich have you given up the subway yet I was so upset with you when I found out that you no. still take the subway. It's he's a bi- his, he's a billionaire. He takes the fucking subway. I'm not a billionaire. Hundreds are you, of are you, is your family not, rich? Not me. You, you My family is rich. That's what I felt. My yeah. career is going great, though. I'll tell yeah, you that. Yeah. I'm making good money now. But you don't Holy need crap. it. Uh, do I need it? No. no <laughs> Mentally, you probably do. It feels good. It feels good to earn. Yeah. Hell yeah. It yes. feels good to earn good money. I love it. Yeah. That was like our friend. You know Nick Mangold on the Jets? No. He was the center on the Jets. He would come in here and... He would take the subway in, and Willie and Large would get so mad at him. They're like, "You drive a Bentley, and you helicopter to practice, but you're taking the fucking subway." But into the, the subway city. is fast. It sometimes. really is. That's it really the thing. Is. I you, took an Uber up here. I'll tell you what. If I don't feel like taking the subway, I don't. Oh, That's good. Yes. But if I feel like taking it, I do. I'm not gonna get in an Uber just even when I want to get in the subway. I just be like, "Oh, but I'm rich. I have to. <laughs> I have to do something fancy. I'm rich." Uh, I just like the subway because I don't like. Being rather around that many people, you don't like. He would rather sit in an Uber for like 40, 50 minutes for oh, like 100%. five blocks really? than just walk it. 
Where we walk in Austin, we walk like three blocks. So it was like absolutely not. It was not. hot. It was hot, and I was wearing thick denim. Are you afraid of being like too famous for the streets? No, and I'm, I'm I'm fine with that. It's just I have to. Um, I don't like being in like I, it's, I don't want. It's like an inconvenience, or you know what I mean. It's just well, it's more convenient. It's not convenient. You wouldn't want to walk. I don't want to share. I don't want to share a social experience with the common people. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah, so it's more of like an elitist complex Elite, it's that elitist, doesn't yeah. stem from you having followers. No. Well, I like this podcast because you're gay, but it's still Barstool. Do you know what I mean? Thank you. Yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah. That's what I like to instill. I appreciate we have, that. We instill our values and everything we do here. Mm-hmm. We do. We do. It's more Barstool than it is gay, but it's pretty gay. Yeah. Really? How more Barstool? Well. Unabashed bro culture? Mm-hmm. You guys are gay bros. You're are we? That's such a... Did you see that movie, you're, wear, you're both wearing backwards snapbacks. We have to legally. We yeah. have a brand deal of 47. Yeah. <laughs> no, we, have to, we have to wear snapbacks. We're legally required. They go, you can work or you just can't yeah. be that gay. Yeah. <laughs> snapbacks yeah. only. They're like, if you're going to be gay, you better cover it up under a hat. Is Miss Peaches uh, gayer than us? Miss Peaches? Is Dave's behavior with Miss Peaches gayer than us sucking dick? <laughs> yes. 100%. I don't know. I never thought of it. I don't think so. Oh, it's so gay. Are you, you kidding? You think? My father Miss would say, what does that queen do? My father, called, <laughs> my father called Dave Horner a queen. That queen is with that little dog in, that, in the prom dress running around. What is she doing? I think, I don't know. I think you've got a, anyone gets a pass with a dog. Like You can be as gay as you want with a dog. I had a dog. I just gave it away. It's Carolyn Banowitz. <laughs> <laughs> oh, They're I the same Carolyn. breed, believe it or not. <laughs> the same breed? Uh, <laughs> Wait, hat really quick. I did my, uh, my, my hair spray. I'm losing my hairline. Feel yeah. It feels like sticky. Nothing happened do? yet. What are you spraying? I'm spraying phenox. What's it called? Finasteride. Finasteride. Oh, okay. it's allegedly my boners will be fine, but the, the I take that. Is still up. But I take that down my throat. <laughs> oh, the <laughs> smile after. <laughs> well, you take a pill? Yeah. How long have you been taking it? Oh, since college. And when is it going to start working? <laughs> uh, you have a nice head of hair. No, you have a great head. Do this. Aww. I want to see your hair line, though. It's always been high, though. In my How mind. old are you? Yeah. Go back this way. I'm 29. You age yeah. that for you. Are you liking that or are you hating that? I, I know it's color. better that it's. you have a good hairline. I love your coloring. Oh. Do you have blonde body hair in the summertime? <laughs> Don't look at my dick when you ask that. I didn't. Yes, <laughs> did you? You're, did. you're covering <laughs> it with the phone. He tried. But then how would the you know that if you way. didn't look at my... <laughs> Uh, I like, have pop up. <laughs> blonde body hair in the summertime, but yeah. my pubes are kind of a dark brown. Mm. Dark brown? Yeah. And that's because you dye them. <laughs> I do. Yes. He's, I, his root, he's phrasing his roots. I, do, I, I Well, what I'll do is I'll do I'll do ginger pubes for the summer. It's G- just lighter and summery. GPs, mm. a little more playful. GPs for the summer. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> How long has it? So it's worked for you, the pill? You're I the think pill. the 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 finasteride is supposed to protect back here more than the front. I believe they make me go. I, I know. I'm, I know I all about cosmetics. I, I just take about this, it because I'm like I, I need it here. This we're issue. all entertainers. Like you'd rather yes. have your hair, and I'm not a good bald guy. I'll tell you that right now. Yeah, yeah. you look creepy if you're bald. Yeah, thank you. Let me like, see not look teeth? creepy. Like you would look like you were a creepy person. I have, you, yeah, no, no. I know what you meant. <laughs> <laughs> you you clarified something that was very clear. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have veneers? <gasps> I need to be a medicine No, today. I don't have veneers. Oh. Hair is the only thing I have been working on. I don't even have a nose job, which is pretty obvious. You don't obvious. need one. I don't think yeah, I do. Yeah, you don't need one. But I've been told I do. By? Uh, all kinds of people, including my own family. But Your own family. You know what? I, my family is... the. We're all Jew, but New York Jews, there's a lot of cosmetic surgeries. It's a rite of passage. It's tasteful. I'll tell you what, it's very tasteful. Yeah. Well, you're you not going to a bad surgeon. No, I know. But, so, <laughs> <laughs> just a yeah. long delay. Um, no, but you know what is, some people like a surgery. Some people like a nose job where you have a pointy button nose, and other people just want a nose job where it's just mostly uh, Taking fine. the mass away. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? <laughs> the mass? <laughs> Like you would lose so much blood if you had to cut that thing off. I got a beak. I got. Would a you get a nose job? The thing I is, I want you got one, but everyone's like, "Don't get one; you'll look weird." I can light a cigarette in a rainstorm with this thing. Well, I don't know what that means, but what I will say is, think about it. You'll get there. <laughs> this, this. I oh, want to take. Oh, I see. That the, makes the, sense. The, that makes sense. This that makes sense. off. That's a good phrase. It's Who came up with that? Large. Large. Yeah. Who's large? He's a comedian that works here. Large. 
Yeah. I don't he's a sandwich that's artist a that works here. He's a, he's a sandwich <laughs> artist. Uh, what I will say is, um, for a man, you never know what's going to happen to the whole package if you change one little thing. Yeah, I don't like. Like, that. I like my whole thing that I I'm would never do with. any kind of modification to my face. I think I've had an adorable little nose. <laughs> I'd look. Oh, have you gotten? A lot you of would work? look different with a I, nose. Yeah, I had my whole head cut off. Really? Much. Yeah. What, what, have, what have you gotten done? Not, not, not plastic surgery. I, my, my whole body's been taken off. But my f- he's had three sixty lipo for like twelve and hours. And my, my breasts done. You've had lipo and my breasts. <laughs> I had them taken out. I had, I had women's breasts. Really? Growing up, yeah. I'm not kidding. Show Google Joey comes out to surgery. <laughs> Google Joey? Want to see, see yeah. me under the knife? Yes. Like a whole hog on the table. You ever seen my surgery video? Uh, a thousand times. <laughs> oh, oh, you vlogged it. That's yeah. how you got it for free. That poppy command was made because of COVID. Who's that Look guy? at that. Look at that. Is that oh! Your, is that your dad? <laughs> yeah. Is that your house? No, this is um, it's pretty clear a hotel. hotel. My house is better. My house is Look at the though. fucking, the drains you have. Why do you have a pet? Look at your bloody undies. Why are you wearing a bloody diaper? Because yeah. that's where all the blood was rushing from my under, um, uh, my pubic bone. Oh! Because they had to cut me here. Gross! To my stomach. Stop! <laughs> what if I just... What Can else? you watch me with my surgery, please? Ew! What part? Where it actually is happening. In the go beginning. to the beginning, Vinny. Like right there. You'll see it. Well, I'm under the knife. There you go. Right there. Boom. Ew, watch this, Joey. Watch this. Oh, oh, my God, dude. Oh, what, what are you, what are you doing? Joey. Why would you put that on YouTube? That's so gross. <laughs> yeah, I can't. I can't. Ew. I can't. Get it Ew. Get Ew. <laughs> Sinner. Oh, my God. Sinner. Oh, my God. I, I can't say. <laughs> But I can, I can be a whole hog on a oh table naked. Oh my naked. gosh. <laughs> that is so that intense. So oh my god. Can we put the Diddy allegations back on? I need yeah. something to comfort me. That's more palatable. Jesus Christ. <laughs> they stuck. What did Ray. they stick in you? Wait, tell them how, tell 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 how long. You. A dowel. Tell them how long it went and how long it was supposed eight. to go. It was supposed to go three, an it's hour, wrong. Two, two hours. It went eight hours. It was supposed the, to go two hours. It took eight. How many liters of the out? That's wrong. They took four. Two liter bottles of soda out. Four soda bottles of Ew. fat. Ew! <laughs> How was the pain after? I didn't feel. I still don't feel anything. I'm numb. Oh. Still numb. What do you mean you're numb? Yeah, I don't. I have no. I can't feel anything. I can't feel my you body. You can't feel that. No. What? You I can't mean, feel your breath. No, you can feel it, but it's like you know, it's like it's it's like heart. You can't really feel it. It's like gross. <laughs> <laughs> that was nasty. That wasn't even the gross part. What are you talking about? What, what was, was the, the gross, gross part? part? Wait, that sliced my tits off and pull, re- reattach my nipples. That, that's on camera? They had to reattach your they nipples? That. He yeah, his pull nipples up, are fantastic. Uh, Joey's nipples being Imagine, re- imagine <laughs> he pulls up the surgery. It's just him getting an intricate bottom surgery. <laughs> the, oh my inver- God. Now we will invert the penis into the body. Wait, they had to reattach your nippies? Yes. Why they would the- they pull your nipples off? That's where they suck the fat out of? Because my nipples are the problem. There's you were lactating <laughs> fat? No, I had... Did you have dinner plates? I had gynecomastia, which is... Male breast tissue. It's like, it's like mm. cone-shaped nipples. No. Ew. They're flat as fuck now. You got. Let's yeah. take. A, let's can see. We take a can we see everything now? Yep. Scars. Oh yeah. No, they sewed those nipples back. It looks like you had top surgery. I did. I know. Yeah. That's what, like, exactly what I had. Oh. Okay. Lucas, because well, I have sense. to go. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean top you know surgery. Trans? I thought you know. <laughs> you vibe like. You you, I thought he, I thought you told me you had on sniffies. Looking I would be trans if I could. You can. I don't want to be a woman, though. I mean, <laughs> like, can. yeah, you can always. You're be a trans. grown man. You as can do long anything. as you're, as long as you have a gender, I might you do can a be a different life gender. transition. But you are, you are trans. You're just not transitioning. I am. That's right. You, you tried to transition. And you beat it. I did. I got rid of it. Okay. Did you I got pray, rid pray of the trans away? I didn't Which pray is away. impossible. I got lazy. <laughs> you know, I, I, I got too lazy. My feet hurt. I couldn't wear those heels anymore. You go. You ever? You ever worn? You wear a scuff pump for seven years. Do the math on like what you can say because you're gay. I can say, say whatever anything, the fuck yeah. I want. Well, this is a free. This is you're think, a white male. You can't. I'm I know, trans, so. but I think you can't say things about black people. Well, yeah, we not that I want to tempt you, <laughs> <laughs> but I think you. No. But I think that's where your gay pass ends. Well, I, would think, well, I wouldn't say anything nasty about gay. I love black people, so I wouldn't say anything nasty about it. I mean, I would say like. And I, observational, <laughs> observational things about every kind of. We just had a show in Atlanta. That's black excellence. Yeah. Any you had a show. People, any black people excellence? can make a Atlanta observation about. I don't think it's black excellence. Bl- to Buck, be a Buckhead white is guy black excellence. <laughs> no, we weren't uh, black. Just excellence. to be clear, we, were, we weren't black excellence. But there was black excellence there amongst us. Right. Oh, okay. Yeah. To, to go to Atlanta to be amongst black excellence is an absolutely acceptable that's what we're trying to say. That's much more articulate yeah. than what I said. <laughs> I go. We were black. excellence. We're gonna have to cut the whole episode. You said that's black excellence, and I went what? 
Well, I guess it's in the eye of the beholder. Black excellence is in the eye of the beholder. Let's move on. Um, what else have we had done? I've had my face done. I've had oh, anyway, I was getting my, my, my lips, Botox. I'm lips, getting M sculpt at 1 p.m. today. Fillers. M sculpt. What's that? Yeah. Do you want to get it? I don't think. Sperling dermatology is the best. They put a machine on your stomach. It does 20,000 crunches in 15 minutes. You I'll can't walk after. It's awesome. I'll tell you what. I'm just going to go to the gym after this. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I'm going to work on myself. How much free testosterone do you have? What is that means? Do you have, when's the last time you had your lipid panels on? <laughs> I don't know what this is. Your blood work. Blood work, so. Oh. Um, Intravenous. I don't. I have not. Not for many, many years. The last time I went to the doctor, uh, I went was for your father physical. Your doctor? My father. <laughs> it was his <laughs> uncle, and it was in his uncle's <laughs> bedroom. <laughs> my father's not a doctor. If my father was a doctor, I'd kill myself. What his, does father, he do? his father's a titan of industry. He's a, he's a CEO. I know, but what kind of company? Uh, media. CEO. Oh. Media. media and is your, da- um, is your dad, um, what's, does that, he, what's the gay guy's name from um, TMZ? Who owned Barstool? It's a media company. Dave Port- oh, Peter Dave Thiel. Portnoy. No, not Peter Thiel. Penn National Gaming. David Portnoy. No, not. The first one. The first oh, guy. Um, what's his name? That guy. You know who I'm Peter about. something. Yes. Chernin. 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 Yes. Chernin. Chernin. My dad and Chernin work together. So he's the CEO of Chernin? No, Chernin's the CEO. CEO Chernin. Of Chernin. <laughs> oh, so who's the CEO? Dad and His dad is—he sold like video games or something. He sells video games in the corner of Twenty Eighth and Ninth or something <laughs> like that. Yeah, the guy who sells jerseys—that's his father. <laughs> but the guy, but he was yeah, he was buddies with the. For all I know, my dad will buy barstool. I don't care. How great would that be? Who would then we, I could who maybe would you fire first? Maybe I could uh, go on some of the other podcasts instead of being a ten-time guest on <laughs> on the gay on the game podcast. Yeah. Um, did you? What was I saying? We were talking about oh, just siblings. I do. How many? Two. Boys or girls? One and one. Oh, are you in the middle? Mm-hmm. That makes sense. That yeah. sucks. I'm in the middle too. It doesn't suck. No, it doesn't suck, but you're not going to get I all was... the money. They have to share it with two people. Mm-hmm. Uh, there's enough to go around, honey. Okay. Well, <laughs> well, yeah, I would say there's enough to go around. Also, my sister has special needs. Oh. oh. She probably should get the more than then. No, she gets less. She gets less? Less? She's special? She doesn't need all of it. What hmm. kind of needs? Very special. She'll never live independently. Oh well, she, so someone's got to work. Someone's got to work for her whole life, though. Who's paying that person? I'm so looking for extra we work with her money. She's got her money already. Yeah. We've siphoned out her money. Oh it's pretty God. good. She's got a good little bag. Are you si- are you skimming? Does she, is she still cocky? Be it, Lucas. Is be honest. Cocky, are you though? skimming? I could skim. Is you she could. still is she cocky still though? <laughs> what? Is she cocky still like to her to the, her handler? Is she like? Peasant, get the fuck out did of here. Fix say, my fi- Did fix you my- just say handler for my sister? <laughs> well, doesn't you she have a full-time say, nurse? She's not an animal. <laughs> you can't say handler. What is her, what's, her, what's her full-time person? Caretaker. Caretaker. Yeah. Is she cocky the caretaker? Uh, she is like cocky, she but not, but no, she, has, she doesn't know she's rich. But she, she doesn't. Is cocky. I'm going to tell her when I see yeah. her. I don't think she understands the concept <laughs> Vinny starts dating her? <laughs> <laughs> Then he goes, this is That's my girlfriend. so interesting. I Saying ex- Handler is the stra- craziest thing I've ever heard. And That's I, wild. It's, it's pretty That's, cool. a, that's not the craziest. Though, a handler. That's not the craziest Celebrities I've ever have a handler? Heard. Yeah. Who has a handler? Vinny's my handler. He is handles true, it. Vinny? He handles that true. dick in his mouth. Okay. Oh. What? What? Did you ever see his, how full his bush is? <laughs> Vinny? I have oh. a picture. I mean, based on Never how full it. his beard is, I can imagine. It's like three times that. Remember the picture I sent you? Of Vinny's. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you keep your bush bushy, Vinny? No. Okay. You Unless can't. Ask. It's musky down. Do you have a, a girlfriend? He'll mat. Yeah, okay. <laughs> He'll mat it down. <laughs> He'll mat if he doesn't thatch it out. You have a girlfriend. Do you want to go on Taylor Watch after this? What's Taylor Watch? <laughs> it's an award winning podcast about Taylor Swift. Is it who won? What? Who's it does it? Kelly Keeks. Gia Marino. Selling a little cha-ching or a lot. Shopify helps you do your thing however you cha-ching. Shopify is a global e-commerce platform that helps you sell at every stage of your business, from the launch your online shop stage to the first real-life in-store stage. So the, all the way, so do we just hit a million-dollar stage? Uh, Shopify's got you covered. Whether you're selling scented soap or offering outdoor outfits, Shopify helps you sell everywhere, from their all-in-one e-commerce platform to their in-person POS system, wherever and whatever you're selling, Shopify has got you covered. They help turn browsers into buyers with the internet's best converting checkout, 36% better on average 
compared to other leading commerce platforms. That's right. I still have a, a Shopify website. It's, it's Joe, the best. Joey I sell door hangers. Um, <laughs> Shopify powers 10% of all e-commerce in the U.S. And Shopify is global force behind Allbirds, Rothy's, Brooklinen, and millions of other entrepreneurial um, sites all across 175 countries. I'm signed for $1 per month trial period at Shopify.com slash out and about, all lowercase. Go to Shopify.com slash out and about now to grow your business no matter what stage you're in. Shopify.com slash out and about. What other shows do you Do we go to? straight oh. upstairs? How does it work? It's, yeah. right, it's on the same seat. You just well, have to, we just have to switch us out. Yeah, we'll have a handle. And change the thing back here. What if I know nothing about Taylor? Is that kind of What do you know about out? Taylor Swift? Smash I, or pass Taylor Swift? That's um, a good question. With that pancake booty. I don't, she's not. Is your dad richer than Taylor Swift? No. Oh. Who's richer Ew. than Taylor Swift? Doesn't Taylor he Swift did. make like... <laughs> did he? Taylor, Taylor, Taylor Swift's Swift. probably almost a billionaire now. No? Probably, almost. Yeah. Let's look up Taylor Swift's net worth. I'll tell you if my dad's richer. Can we borrow some money? Yes. Thank you. If it's in a... Oh, yeah. No, my dad's not richer than Taylor Swift. Okay. Now yeah. we also, just start... <laughs> we go, look up Joey Kamas. I don't know. Network. She's... Go Google it. It's six million. Wait, why do you have so much money? It's a can't be from this. Um, no, it's not from this. I'm a, I'm a reality star. Now, this is written by Joey. <laughs> it says, um... Oh, Matt Cosmetics. Matt Cosmetics in 1997. He's close with Moore and Ross Matthews. Did you actually do that? Yeah. Birthplace. You're a Capricorn. Capricorn, January 3rd. Are you a... Net worth, there it is. Oh, I only have 5.5 million. Is that true? No, it's much more. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> can you look up my net worth? Let's see if let's see if we can find it. He doesn't know your name. Lucas. L-U-C-Z-E-L. Yeah, how do you spell the last name? <laughs> well... Look up his dad. Just my tour dates. Will that make you uncomfortable? Do you think Vinny's a dumb jock? <laughs> He's uh, straight, well, white, and wealthy. He is described as... <laughs> that is unbelievable. Where does it say that? That is fucking He's described insane. as straight, white, and wealthy. I've never seen that. Makes jokes about hot bucket topics from race, gender, to sexuality. I'd love to hear some of the sexuality jokes. Traditional stand-up and, and viral TikTok star posting clips from his sets, including shocking audience heckles, interactions, underage children, and Zelnicki has knowledge. His Zelnicki? Success. Where the fuck did that come from? This is an AI. Do you use AI? I've been no. starting to use ChatGPT. Go to ChatGPT.com. That's what you wrote about Ashley Madison. It is. You can type anything. It's fucking incredible. I have it on my phone. All right, what do we want to ask ChatGPT? Well, um, what your net worth is. No, it's ask, not like ask, that. Ask for a bio of Joey. Who is Joey Camasta? Yeah. I don't think it'll say that. It goes, it goes, it goes a fat <laughs> from. Gay Jersey Shore. Is a comedian, podcast host, social media personality. Okay. <laughs> he often shares... Funny LGBTQ and, plus, how many times are going to put that LGBT culture, pop culture, and everyday life. Kamasi is also known for Can his ask involvement if, in LGBT it, advocacy work does Chad as GBT an know who in the I community. Am? Can you ask if Chad GBT knows who I am? And then we're going to ask about Barstool Pat. I think I should put my last name on the internet instead of just being Barstool Pat. And that won't make you any more famous. Oh, oh no. boy. What's it say? That is... As I said, say, well-known public <laughs> figure... <laughs> Oh, a lesser, lesser known, known personality. <laughs> no, uh, now I'm afraid. Okay. Do who is Barstool Pat? This is gonna be. Not, it's gonna say who? <laughs> it's gonna go. It goes. It goes. Who says? <laughs> what that? What's that now? Pat oh my God. <laughs> no. Fuck you guys. I know that. Oh, it's that's the wrong, wrong one. That's the NFL kicker. I um, always get Khalifa and McAfee. McAlifa. Okay. Good. Hopefully, Pat. Good for you. Does it say I'm a Matt? What's it say? You're a nobody, just Damn. like me. Is a private individual. You're very private. We know. Why don't we you. look up who is Jaminate's killer? Yes. Who is Jaminate Ramsey's killer? Actually. Yeah. That? Are we allowed to use that? Well, we don't have to do that. Kill. You can't right say kill on internet. I can show my fucking whole pussy getting sucked out on YouTube, <laughs> but I can't say. I can't say. I need a warning next time. We're gonna watch something. Did you get boned oh, up? I don't know. Afterwards, would you have would you, but... would you have penetrated me if if I had a pussy and I was sleeping like that on the table? Oh, I got a good question after this. <laughs> Pre or post surgery? <laughs> no, during the surgery. Oh, oh, during no. Would you use your cock and stick it in my stomach to suck like the suck the fat? Out? Would you fuck my stomach hole? If <laughs> your cock, if, that, if that's if, what you needed, if just answer the question, Vinny. If that's what would fix it. Yeah. Vinny, why are you being so standoff? We, and we just answer whether you'd fuck his open. If gap. you were working, you... <laughs> don't be ridiculous. If you were working and like, if there was a really famous person, you were a doctor and they were under the knife, 
and like you had a chance to look at their titties, would you take a peek? Like oh, if just, Michelle just Obama, look. like we talked about on Barcel Breakfast, if Michelle Obama yeah. was like under the knife, you'd like take a look just at Michelle look, Obama's yeah. titties. Yeah, yeah. You would. Would you take a peeky poo? Is that yeah. what you're saying? Yeah. I'm Michelle Obama. Yeah. Yeah. Or at anyone's tits under. Or would you like if there was like a famous guy? Would you like take a look at his hog under the knife? Am, am I Stone spoke? Cold Steve Austin? Let, let's just. <laughs> <laughs> Why are Michelle Obama and Stone Cold Steve Austin your My two, two favorite go-to celebrities? celebrities? <laughs> Wait, so the question is, if say I'm a surgeon, yes, and I don't have to look at Stone Cold's hog unless I choose to take a little peeky poo, yes, would I take a peeky poo? Yes. Um, gosh, I think that's malpractice. It no one knows. Malpractice. Maybe I'm too financially motivated. <laughs> no but one But I would knows. be like, hey, I'm guaranteed that no one would know. Yeah. So it's like a tree falls in the forest. Can I see his tree in the right. forest? Kind or your like right hand man is your resident is like, dude, look, and you're like, no, would you go <laughs> and take a peek? If my res for the sake of like social camaraderie, yeah, I wouldn't be like, yeah. ew, dude. I'd be like, oh, <laughs> it's Damn. smaller than I thought. But then, but yeah, but I will oh say, looking at, I couldn't be a surgeon because looking at what fucking Joey put on YouTube is disgusting. That's, only, that's I don't part know how that's wrong. There's still part it's one. You need wrong. to see part one. Oh, Joey, it's wrong. How is that allowed on YouTube? I don't understand. It's because I'm, 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 a female body is a beautiful thing. <laughs> you should be able to see it in all its glory. <laughs> that's true. When's your next procedure? You're going to Turkey for the hair. I don't want to go there. Can I see? You're, you're going to need some mic. You're going to need a microscope. I would do it now, probably. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, because it's not bad, but you don't want to go from bald back to hair. That's a weird look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why I think so, I'm stopping it at the right time. But I got great, like, this isn't growing at all. That's the issue. The what, sides of your hair? Yeah, what do you like, mean this doesn't growing? grow. This grows like 5x what this grows. And then this is like. <sighs> but that's okay. Does that Thank matter? Thank you. Yeah, I think maybe that'll bring me happiness that I've been searching for. Having so you hair. guys should both go to Turkey together and you should do a vlog. Yeah. Liam for the 508 just called me. I would be down. Liam. So look how short my shorts are. That's, I mean, that's like a lot. Thank God you don't have a bulge. I think it'll be popping I'm tucked. Uh, talking. I guess. Well, where's, this has been lovely. Where's Jamie? Jamie? Yeah. He's in Vancouver right are now. Are you guys still buddies? Yeah. You still do your show? We sure do. When's your show come out? Tomorrow. Damn. Will it come out? Well, yeah, it's come a live out. show, but we have it tomorrow. Where's your live show? Uh, Lower East Side Sesh Comedy. Every Tuesday. Where is oh, it? you do a live show every Tuesday. Yeah, oh, we do. We do like m new material together. I mean, not together, but like we each run new bits. It's just for anyone that wants to come see us. I mean, it's usually sold out every week. It's sold out tomorrow. Oh, it's, wow. it's a smaller room, so it's it sells out kind of on How its many own. Seats? 72. Oh, that's good. Yeah. But for stand-ups, I mean, that's... Yeah. It's a normal size New York room. But yeah. like we take a couple weeks off when I'm on the road. I don't know if he's in town tomorrow, but Can anyway... Can you work I just, me into your, into your skit tomorrow and I'll come to the show? What do you mean available. work you in? <laughs> like, would you tell a story about me? I mean, what I saw you put online today, <laughs> I would probably start the show and go, I know this is a comedy show, but I need to have a very sobering moment with each and every one of you. <laughs> there was a pig I saw getting <laughs> slaughtered on a table. Yesterday, you ever seen I a saw pig on a, spigot? <laughs> a sinner do the wrongest thing I've ever seen, and I'm not talking about gay. Yeah. I'm talking about liposuction is that what i saw is yeah. that what liposuction is that's well, wrong she mess in liposuction we have a gay video of joey as well on the internet i'm not showing him that yeah, i'll tell that. you what i know that gay is like not supposed to be allowed according to the bible but if, <laughs> if such... i'm thinking about <laughs> okay why, listen why, i know why are the bible already? says it's wrong but if liposuction existed 2000 years ago i promise you they'd have put It'd that as bible. wrong that's above gay. <laughs> that is the most yeah. unnatural sinner shit i've ever that is seen dude that's grotesque that was disgusting but you'd rather just disgusting. Stra you're just gonna strap a fucking robot to your stomach so you don't want to fucking sit up <laughs> i don't know what your thing. tits looked like before you got them cut off but i would have titty fucked you not to do that yeah <laughs> have you ever done a titty fucking i've titty fucked damn titty fucking is a great time tf is I mean, it's it's a childish thing to do, right? You know? It's kind of one of those sexual acts that you're half enjoying and half laughing. You do it for just to say you've done it. It's like coming in your pants. Like it's oh. it's as enjoyable as it is funny. I agree. <laughs> do you Have you ever come in your pants? No, darling, you must. <laughs> <laughs> it's gorgeous. Yeah, good. We look over here smoking a cigarette, <laughs> darling. You must. <laughs> oh, Have you come ever back to me over here in the blue chair. <laughs> Have you ever came in your pants? Yeah. How? In your pants? It's so easy to come in your pants. Yeah. As a young one? You've just been touching? Like, Are we like rubbing against I've, I've come on my I've come in my pants uh 
at least twice, three times, I'll let you guys be the judge if this counts as a come in the pants. If someone is giving you an over the pants hand job vigorously for a while and then you come in there, oh, so that's, does that count yeah, as coming in the pants? Yeah. Who's I'll giving under the, over the hands hand jobs? Eighth um, graders. <laughs> have you ever been in ninth grade? No. I feel like you're. I thought you meant just like sitting there and it happens. No, no it's not like. <laughs> but, but, <laughs> pretend, pretend it's slow. It's slow. not like a divine cum. But, but I, it's not a DC. <laughs> an immaculate conception. Yeah, it's not. But a, it's I, not what I have it. had is someone kind of humping me. Hi. <laughs> you got to put it on speaker. <laughs> oh, it was. You had someone <laughs> humping you. <laughs> I just took a yeah, phone call. I've humped my way into a cum, and I've humped your way into a cum. Been jerked off into a cum. No, what was his name? Um, it was Jamie. <laughs> <laughs> James Lewis. What's your girlfriend's possible. name? Her Ooh, name is Kitty. Mm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> she's well, great. Well, this is awkward. <laughs> she's, she's a short-haired tabby. <laughs> <laughs> What's your boyfriend's name? Um, Bay. Okay, so maybe we shouldn't be throwing things yeah, around. Yeah, that's right. Wait, B-A-E? What's her? B-A-E. Yeah. Because B-A-E-U. he wants to be anonymous on this podcast? Yeah. Oh, well, then why the fuck would you ask me a question you're not pre- pre- prepared to answer in the reverse direction? That's Curiosity? Valid. Curiosity killed the kitty? <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been dating? Did you uh, tell her you're going to murder her kitty? What? Yeah. Do you say I'm going to murder your kitty? I try not to say that. Because then it's like you're murdering her and then it'll be on record that you said it. I think it's just a crazy thing to say to your girlfriend. Right. Yeah. So we should also, stop I wouldn't saying say what I do in the bedroom is murdering anything. It's more... Hmm. Um, w- warm. Warm. Oh, you got... Remember you got a tattoo of his ex-girlfriend? No, I didn't remember that. What happened to that? You covered up? No, it's right there. Where is it? Right there. That's your ex. Um, you don't want to talk about it. Ex current. Oh, it's your current. I thought you had got a. I thought that was a. You've been dating the same girl for a while, then. We broke up for a sec, but we got back together. Oh damn! That's nice. That's yeah. lovely. Yeah. You know what? Getting back with the ex feels real nice. A rekindle. Oof. Yeah. Oh, Oof. God. Don't get me going. Oof. <laughs> well, cause it's, it's, it's nice because you know that you tried, went out there, and that, that that's even more wholesome. It's like yeah. I went out there. There's, no, your, there's no one else. You, no one can fill your void. Love yep. you the whole time. Yeah, yeah, you're the only and one she for loved me. me. And then you come back together and you're like, oh. How long was your break? Eight months. It's a long I, break. Who made the first move back? She did. What'd she, she say? You. Did she take you out to dinner and was like, I love you? <gasps> I take Poppy out to dinner tonight. It was sweet. It was kind of, it wasn't super far off from that. It was, but you both knew it was coming. Asking um, for a friend. <laughs> oh, do you have an ex you want to rekindle? No, no, no. Maybe. No. Maybe. What? Back to you. Uh, back to you. <laughs> what happened? Back she to took you. you out to dinner? We met up for drinks and it was really nice. And then that was just, you were off to the races. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. I mean, I wasn't really going to meet up if I wasn't at least prepared to maybe be off. To smash at least. For sure that was yeah. on the... <laughs> <laughs> sure that was on For sure day. that. Should we, go to a Lu- should we go to Lucas' show? You should. Tomorrow? Yeah. I have... <laughs> <laughs> it should be somewhere tomorrow but where do you have to go I have to look at my phone I forgot god damn Lucas when does your podcast come out and when? where can people buy tickets to your comedy um, lucaselnick.com for my comedy okay. all tour dates um, and He's texting now she will tour.com for our tour dates. dates yep um, and can I go home now is the name of my podcast it's really funny okay yeah. And that's what he's thinking All right straight. now. Yeah. He's actually, can I go home now? He's texting his Uber right now. Can I go home now? <laughs> well, this has been lovely. Thank you for coming on. Thank you for having me. We appreciate it, Lucas. We hope you have a wonderful summer. We hope that your career continues to flourish. And I we, hope you and Kitty get married. And I hope you I and hope Kitty get married. Too. Thank you Stop. so much. Stop. Thanks for coming. Thanks appreciate for it. Me. Love you. Love you too.